Guys, question for you. How often do you Google a day? We know a lot, right? The popular search engine is an important part of our lives and it definitely shows how to celebrate changing up its logo to mark birthdays, special occasions, national days. You've seen that on the on the page. Well, every year it also hosts its doodle for Google contest calling for creative designs from folks all across the country. And this morning we're joined by joined by Ella Kinnersley, who is the Arizona winner. That's right. Arizona's competition with her sloth inspired design and now she's in the running for the <laughs> national contest. Thanks for being here and congratulations. Thanks for having me. <laughs> this is so exciting, right? Yeah. You have always loved sloths and how what was inspiration just getting this design? Um, well, I really had in mind how some species of sloths are endangered and um, the theme was when I grow up, I hope dot dot dot. Uh huh. And when I grow up, I hope that these species of sloths will no longer be endangered. Oh, I love that. <laughs> Obviously, it's making its mark with a great design. You're an artist. <laughs> Have you always just loved doodling or is this something you want to do professionally um, one day? Well, I've always loved to draw, but when recently I found out that in Google there's a whole team that just does doodles for the um, homepage, I thought that would be a cool job option when I grow up. I would, maybe <laughs> you'll be that one day. Yeah. So we are actually in the final day of voting right now. We are in the final day. Tell us what's the easiest way to get that vote in because it's so important. Okay, so um, if you Google, doodle for Google, okay. and uh, go to the page, there's an option to vote. And mine is um, the sloth one in the grade eight to nine category. We have the banner here of, uh, to get a closer look. I know she has it on her t-shirt, but this is mom and dad holding this proudly for you. Um, that would be pretty neat if this was a the winner and then it was on for a while, right? Yeah, that would be really fun. <laughs> I would love that. Now, we speak of little surprises and yesterday you got quite the surprise. I believe we have that video. Tell me about your meeting with a real sloth. <laughs> yeah, yesterday I got to meet um, Phoenix Zoo's Fernando the Sloth and <laughs> um, I got to pet him and like watch them feed him, which was really fun. Was what what is it about a sloth that you love? What, there it is. There's Fernando. I don't know. I just they're like really cute. I love their <laughs> their big noses and you know their derpy hands. <laughs> um, and yeah, I I don't know. I just love them. <laughs> Did you, was he ex what you expected in a real sloth? Um, he was a little different. I kind of when I was sure, talking moves fast, huh? Yeah, when I was talking to his <laughs> keeper, I learned that um, they can actually move kind of fast, like when they want to. But most of the time, they just stay pretty slow. Well, you know what I love about uh, your design is that it sends a message, right? It mm -hmm. sends a message. What's the most shocking thing that you found in learning about sloths? I, you know, they're endangered, and you, you say one day, hopefully, yeah. they won't be. Well, um, well, I was actually like doing some research, research last night, and I found that there used to be the species of sloth that was apparently elephant-sized. What? I mean, yeah, they're extinct now, but they're, they were called like the giant ground sloth. <laughs> oh my god. So yeah, and I thought that was crazy. I would be a little scared to come across a, a sloth <laughs> the size of an elephant. Yeah. Well, we are so excited for you. This is a huge deal, guys. So again, it's your mm -hmm. chance to vote so that Ella will make it into the national, she's already in the national competition, but in the final five, right? So yeah. right now it's for your age group, ninth graders are going into 10th grade yeah. at Valley Vista mm -hmm. High School. So, what, so send your message. This is your message right now to tell everybody <laughs> to go vote. Please vote for me. <laughs> She's too kind. Vote for her now. Get online. Go to Google Doodle. And again, just look for Ella. She's in the ninth grade category. And we're, we're keeping our fingers crossed. And we're voting right now for the final five for you. <laughs> Thank Good luck. You. By the way, we should tell people what you win if you oh, are in yeah. that, that category, right? Yeah, if I win um, number one, um, it's a $30,000 college scholarship. Ooh. <laughs> All right, yeah. we are rooting for you. I think your design is beautiful. Look at that Thank sloth you. sanctuary. And it's it's just professional and it should be <laughs> the page one day. We'll, Thank you. We'll be looking out for you. Thanks, Ellen. <laughs> Congratulations. Get voting, peeps. Represent Arizona. Yeah. <laughs>